Hi everyone and welcome back to 4 Teachers. In today's video I am bringing you a massive teacher clothing haul. So here is the bag that I have ordered and been sent from ASOS. It contains lots of teacher clothing. It also contains a few, I think, random teaching items which I found which I thought might be quite nice for my classroom. Hi! <laughs> I have also been sent a box! So without further ado, I'm going to open up these giant ASOS parcels and show you all of the new teacher outfits that I have ordered for this year. I really wanted to order some smarter trousers that I could pair up with the teacher tops that I already have in my wardrobe. So I think I've ordered a couple of pairs of trousers in this haul. I really like the colour, I really like the feel of the material. It feels like quite good quality but I think these were quite cheap. But yeah, I really like the look of them. I'm going to have a little try on and let you know what I think. Here are the high-waisted trousers on me. Maybe they're a little bit tight but I quite like the fit. I love that they're high-waisted as well, I think that's a really flattering style. I have got a cropped jumper from the brand Brave Soul. It doesn't often get ridiculously cold here in Hong Kong, but I do like to buy a couple of sort of layering jumpers just to put on top of my smart teacher tops. So hopefully this is going to be nice. The material feels really good. I like the cropped style because I'm only five foot five. I do like to wear a cropped style. I think it makes me look a little bit taller. I will try this on now, maybe with the trousers that I've just shown you and see how it looks. So I've got the jumper on now, it feels really, really comfortable. It's really, really hot for a day like today, but hopefully in a couple of months when the colder weather starts to hit, this will be a perfect outfit to have in my teacher wardrobe. Maybe once I have my school lanyard on, this will look a little bit smarter. I do think it's acceptable to wear as a school teacher. Maybe it will be a little bit of a throw over jumper, but I do really like the fit, so I think I will be adding this straight to my teacher wardrobe. Okay, next item. Next thing I've ordered is a cropped checkered shirt. I think this is really, really smart. I think this is gonna look really nice with a black pair of trousers while I'm teaching. I love the cropped style, but I also love how smart it is as well. I really wanna try and wear a couple more shirts. I think I've shied away from shirts in the past because I feel like I hate having a bulky layer here by my neck. But I feel like this material is really, really thin and really, really soft and hopefully it won't bother me too much around my neck all the time. This is from the brand Boohoo. Let me know what you guys think. I have also ordered an ASOS brand pale pink shirt. Again, I'm looking to add a few more shirts into my teacher wardrobe, but I do find that the neck can bother me a bit. So the ones that I have ordered are very, very thin on the top. I really like the style of this. I love that it's cropped. With pale colors, I always worry that maybe it will be a bit see-through, um, and I really don't want that when I'm teaching. When you wear teacher outfits, I think it's very important to feel completely comfortable in them. Hopefully this doesn't show anything underneath. If not, maybe I can layer it with a vest top or something like that. I will try this on now. Please let me know what you think. I really like this a lot. I think it would go well with chino trousers. I think it would go really well with all the different skirts that I've got. It's gonna be a great addition to my teacher wardrobe. Next item, I've got some shoes from a brand called Raid, which I actually haven't heard of before, but I saw these online. I thought they were really, really good for a school teacher outfit. I've ordered them in a size 5 UK, so hopefully they will be big enough for me because my feet have a very strange kind of half size thing going on where one is a five, one is a five and a half. I think I maybe ordered wide fit because I always think it's much more comfortable, especially when you're teaching and you're having to run around classrooms and run outside to collect the children at playtime. But I think these look really, really smart. I really like the look of them. Hopefully they fit me okay. I will show you them on now and you guys can have a look as well. I feel like they look really smart, I think they're very comfortable, they're going to be perfect for wearing in the classroom. I feel like a lot of the items in this haul are shirts and trousers, I suppose that's the kind of look I'm going for with my autumn and winter teacher wardrobe. I really like the colour of this shirt, I really like the look of the style. I have one that's really similar in white that was from Miss Selfridge that I put in my last teacher clothing haul, so hopefully if it fits anything like that one I'm going to feel really comfortable teaching in this one too. Let me know what you guys think!
Whenever you do an ASOS haul, I feel like the vision is you'll probably keep about half of the items and send the other half back. At least that's what I tell myself I'm going to do. I say like, oh, I'm gonna spend a lot of money, but actually I'm gonna send half of it back. So it doesn't really count. But actually so far in this haul, I'm finding that I've really liked all the items so far. I really like this top. I love the color. I don't think I own anything else in this color. It's the first time I've worn this sort of rusty orangey red color and I really, really like it. I think it looks really seasonal, really nice. Makes me feel like it's autumn time and winter time, even though in Hong Kong it's still really sunny. I still wanna feel the seasons, even though I live so far from home. I am gonna to need to wear it with a vest, but I think that's absolutely fine. I really, really like the style. It's very floaty, very free. I really like the material as well. Another successful item for my teacher wardrobe from this ASOS haul. Next thing I have ordered is a jumper from the brand Brave Soul. That's the second jumper I've ordered from this brand now. It feels like it could be one of those itchy jumpers, so hopefully it's not. I'm gonna try it on now and see if it looks how I envision it looking. But maybe this one, I don't necessarily think is smart enough for teaching in. Maybe this is gonna be more of a layer that I put on top of a different teaching outfit and I wear to get into work, but maybe take off when I get there. Maybe I'll save this for weekend wear. <laughs> Here is the jumper that I ordered. I don't think there's a lot to really say about this jumper. It's nice, it's fine, it's a nice jumper. I don't necessarily think it's going to be an addition to my teaching wardrobe. I think it's more of a weekend jumper. It's cozy, but I wouldn't say it's really smart enough to be teaching in. Obviously, my opinion of teacher clothing will differ from yours, and that's absolutely fine. But for myself personally, I always like to choose an item of clothing that makes me feel confident and a little bit smarter. So I don't really think I would be wearing this in the classroom. Maybe I would wear it on a school trip day. Next item is another pair of shoes. It's come in this really big box. It says Park Lanes Shoes on the side. Again, not a brand that I've heard of before, but I think I remember what this is. Let me just check. So I feel like this style of shoe is absolutely perfect for a school teacher. I think it's very, very comfortable, but also looks very, very smart. I feel like I can wear a black skirt, tights, and these boots, but also these team up really well with black crop trousers. In fact, any color crop trousers. And I just think it's a really good addition to a teacher wardrobe. It's a really good staple item to have. I've also ordered these in a wide style fit size 5. Hopefully these will be perfect for my teacher wardrobe. I really like them a lot. These are the boots that I ordered. I think they're really really smart. They're perfectly comfortable. The wide fit on the front is making them extra comfortable for my feet. I think these are going to go really well with tights, leggings, skirts, trousers, <laughs> basically everything. I think they're very very smart and I'm very very happy with them. The next thing that I ordered actually has nothing to do with teaching. It's just a random bonus item that I like the look of. It's just a cropped hoodie. I really, really like the print on it. Nothing to do with teaching. I won't be wearing this in the classroom. I guess it might be a really nice cover up and I can throw it over the top of my outfit when I'm traveling into work, but I mostly just bought this because I thought it would be nice to wear in Japan next year. Maybe I'll show it to you anyway, just because I threw it into the mix. Next thing I have is an ASOS brand pair of black trousers. I wanted to get some black trousers that didn't have a zip but still look smart, so I could just pull them on and off a little bit easier than having to zip up trousers. It's very, very hot in Hong Kong. Even in the winter time, it still gets quite humid, so I just wanted something that was a little bit easier to throw on and off in the morning but still made me look quite smart as a school teacher. I will show you them on now and we can see if they look smart enough. These are the trousers. I'm not entirely convinced by them. I don't really like the length. I think it cuts at a really strange point on my ankle here. They don't feel like a particularly nice material either, so I'm probably not gonna keep these ones. Next item, what is this? I can't actually remember ordering these, but I've got some trousers in a pink floral. Maybe these would be quite nice for a holiday in Japan as well. They kind of have like a floral design and they're gonna fit me about ankle height, I think. I can't really remember ordering these. Anyway, I'm gonna try these on and just see if they look smart. They definitely need a really good iron, so it's probably not the best time to be trying them, but I think I will show them anyway and just see if they might look smart enough for the classroom. If not, I will probably save these for my holidays next year. Here are the trousers on. I don't really like them. They don't really feel like enough material. I don't think they feel like they're very well made. I don't really like the way they fit here. I know that they need an iron, but it just doesn't feel like a good quality pair of trousers to me. So I don't think I'm gonna be keeping these. Ooh. 
So this is something that I've ordered for my classroom. It is a frame and you can clip things on. Oh. I thought it might be quite nice to take some Polaroid pictures with the students in my class and then we can clip them along here. It says dream, sparkle and shine and I think this will be really nice just to fill up. I'm not sure where I'm going to put it yet, maybe on my desk. I think it would be really nice to add to this throughout the year. Maybe every time we have a special event in school I can take some photographs with my Polaroid camera and we can put them up on here just so the children can see those memories and I think it will feel quite special, like a nice part of our classroom. And of course it's something that I can reuse with the class that I get next year. Year, so quite a nice little teacher investment. <laughs> I'm really excited to start using this. This next item is probably the item that I'm most excited for. For a couple of weeks now I've been really excited to treat myself to a brand new watch. I think it's something that's very very important for a teacher to have. Hopefully this will be the one for me. I think it's something that will be very very helpful as a school teacher when you're outside with the children and it's break duty and you can't remember what time to bring them in. If you don't have a clock on display at all times it can be really helpful to have one on your wrist. This is the watch that I have ordered. I think it looks really really beautiful, it's absolutely perfect for what I wanted. I feel like it's going to go really nicely with all my outfits that I have as a school teacher and I cannot wait to start using this on Monday. As always, I like to throw a little reminder into these videos that what you wear as a school teacher has to be something that you feel comfortable in and you feel professional in. It took me a very, very long time to find outfits that made me feel that way. And my teacher style is changing all the time. Don't worry too much about dressing like a school teacher. I feel much more confident now that I'm buying clothes that I would wear outside of the workplace and inside of the workplace. I don't feel like I'm compromising my own personal style. And I feel like since I introduced that rule, my own personal confidence has improved a lot depending on what I wear. If you have found this video inspiring or useful in any way please consider subscribing to 4 Teachers and please let me know in the comments what your favourite outfit is that I tried on during this haul. Please tag me in your teacher autumn looks over on Instagram. I love to get inspiration from other school teachers. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you again on the next video.